Preparing floating cargo hoses, commonly used in the offshore oil and gas industry for transferring crude oil and petroleum products, is critical for maintaining their safety and efficiency. These hoses are exposed to extreme conditions like harsh marine environments, UV radiation, oil and chemical exposure, and mechanical wear. Failure of these hoses can lead to operational downtime, environmental hazards, and significant financial costs. In this video, we will see a physically damaged cargo hose undergoing repair at an offshore facility. Here's how the repair process can be approached, including potential materials and methods, often utilizing advanced polymer and composite repair solutions like those from Belzona. Before any repair work begins, the extent of the damage should be evaluated. Key issues may include abrasion of the outer cover, punctures, splits, or leaks in the hose body, damage to the end fittings or couplings. After identifying the damage, the affected area should be cleaned and prepared. Contaminants like oil, dirt, salt water, and marine growth must be removed. Abrasive blasting or manual sanding can be used to roughen the surface to enhance adhesion of the repair materials. Once clean, the repairing activities can be done. Belzona's elastomeric repair solutions are often used to repair floating cargo hoses due to their high flexibility, resistance to chemicals, and abrasion resistance. Here are the typical materials involved. Belzona 2111 Adanda High Build Elastomer Compound, a versatile, flexible rubber repair compound designed to restore the hose's outer cover, providing protection against future wear and damage. It's commonly used to repair splits, punctures, or worn areas. Belzona 2211, a MP high build elastomer compound, a product specifically designed for flexible repairs and is ideal for hoses that require resilience to impact, abrasion, and chemical attack. It can be applied to repair leaks or restore the hose's structure while maintaining flexibility. Belzona 1111, or called Super Metal, can be used for repairs near the end fittings or areas where the hose structure is compromised. Belzona 1111 can be used to rebuild damaged metal parts or reinforce areas that require additional strength. There are also instances where all three compounds can be used to resolve the damage. In many cases, applying a reinforcement layer over the repaired area improves the hose's overall strength and flexibility. This can involve impregnating a fabric or fiberglass mesh with the Belzona elastomer, which is then wrapped around the damaged area for additional protection and durability. Once the reinforcement is in place, an additional coating layer of Belzona elastomers may be applied over the entire repaired section. This final layer helps protect against future damage from UV, abrasion, and chemical exposure. Belzona repair systems are designed for fast curing, allowing for quick return to service. The repairs can typically be completed within hours, minimizing operational downtime and avoiding costly hose replacement. Belzona materials are resistant to a wide range of chemicals, including oils, fuels, and solvents. This ensures the long-term durability of the repairs, even in harsh marine environments. Benefits of using Belzona for floating cargo hose repairs. One, minimizes downtime as its fast curing properties allows for quick repairs and return to service. Two, cost-effective and extends the operational life of the hose, reducing the need for expensive replacements. Three, durability with high resistance to chemicals, abrasion, and environmental factors ensures long-term performance. Four, the elastomers maintain flexibility, even in extreme conditions, allowing the hose to function as intended without compromising integrity. By utilizing advanced polymer-based solutions, the integrity of floating cargo hoses can be restored effectively, ensuring safe and efficient operations. We hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and support the channel by subscribing and liking the videos.